I rent two farms. Um, I don't own a farm at all. I keep 20 pedigree Charolais cows and 160 breeding ewes, which are also pedigree sheep. Um, I have to have a high-end product that I've got to sell, um, A, to pay the rent uh, and the feeds, but I find that the Charolais is one of the best converters. Um, I take, I take uh, brewer's grains out of the local brewery, so it helps my feed costs. Um, I look at all different kinds of aspects of this sort of thing to keep my costs down. I need a high producing animal. What I'm personally looking for is a, a bull that will breed me good females as well as bulls. Um, but also I'm looking for a bull that will produce animals that, I can, that are very saleable to the commercial producer. So I'm looking for a bull with a good top all the way through into the loin, a good springer rib and a, a nice smooth flat shoulder uh, for ease of carving and a, and a good back end. Um, very important weight gains um, at 400 days for the killing out so the animals can be finished at the right age. So uh, um, our main value of the animal of a commercial man is when he comes to buy a bull, he wants a good top, good through the, good through the, the top, full of meat, and then rising straight off over the pins into the plates. Um, the back end wants to be nicely rounded and, and fitted well to the bull with, without too much lumpy, lumpiness in the muscle. So he's a nice smooth sort of finish to him. Um, a lot of people are looking for a serious amount of width but personally, I like to see a bull that's thick in the back end, but as thick in the front, so he's like a tube all the way through.